Jake Cooley with the stoolie back at the comic. Fox, we got Knackle Stack versus Striker. We decide the winner by strength, speed, durability, powers, and IQ. Let's get it. Starting off with Knackle Stack, strength wise, it's pretty mid being a 60 out of a 112. Speed's pretty bad being a 35 out of a 67. Its defense is actually good, though, being a 100 out of a 184, but its powers consist of super durability, it being a rock type with normal rock ground and steel attacks to its repertoire. But now to Striker, who strength-wise was actually able to defeat Molina and was also able to defeat Cabal, but speed-wise, Striker just doesn't even have any feats in that department. Durability wise, he was able to take attacks from Ermac, which is pretty insane. But his powers really consist of not even really having any powers, really. I mean, we could say he has super strength, speed, and durability, but who knows? He has weapons, though, and the IQ obviously goes to him. I honestly have to go with Striker winning, and it was really hard because the durability is the only aspect that I took out of this to decide the winner. Because I honestly think Striker is stronger than this Pokemon, but the Pokemon seems faster and actually has powers, unlike Striker, who actually has an IQ. But yeah, I just have to go with just taking attacks from Ermac being better than a 100 out of a 184. And I only, if he had a great durability, like if it was up there with like the 160s, 150s, I would honestly have said Knackle Stack wins. But. A bullet's going right through that Pokemon's head eventually. And, yeah, it'll get tased. And, yeah, with all that being said, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below who y'all think would win. And I'm out of here. Deuces.